Welcome to www.north underscore Carolina dot health source Cairo dot com slash city slash Greensboro. Today's topic, the three most common causes of back pain. There are so many causes of back pain that people pinning down the exact reason can be difficult at best, impossible at worst. Some common causes are anything from sleeping on a bed that's not the correct firmness to the result of an accident that they may have had in the past. Understanding these causes can help to find out exactly why the back pain is occurring, the best way to relieve it, and possibly how to prevent it in the future. There are some common causes of back pain that everyone should know about so they can be avoided. Number one, the first common cause is sleeping wrong in a bed that's not made to the correct firmness that's needed. It may be a mattress that's too hard or maybe too soft, either of which could be a cause of back pain. Many times people don't think about the firmness of their mattress or how it could affect the way that they feel after they wake up. When shopping for a new mattress, be sure to thoroughly research all of your options to find just the right one to meet your needs. Number two, another cause of back pain is sitting in a specific position for an extended period of time. This may be because of a job that requires computer work or because playing a video game or watching TV for an extended period of time. This is because a lack of movement can create back pain that's hard to deal with. When a person is working for long periods of time at their computer, they may experience chronic back pain. One of the best ways to avoid back pain is to get up periodically and walk around, stretching every once in a while. And number three, another very common cause of back pain is an injury. When there is an injury, such as a car accident or a fall, there may be a strain of the muscles in the back. This can make everyday things painful to do. They may notice that there is more pain than there was before the accident that they had. While there isn't really any type of avoidance with this cause, it's important to note that if you experience this type of back pain, you need to seek the advice of a medical professional as soon as possible. If you find that you are suffering from back pain for any of the above reasons, or for any reason at all, and it isn't rectified within a couple of days, it is important to make an appointment with your doctor. Many things can go wrong with the spinal column, and if not properly treated, you can end up in bad shape. Oftentimes, a doctor will automatically prescribe drugs to counteract the pain. If you would rather use a form of treatment that's not a drug, ask your physician about seeing a chiropractor. A chiropractor is specially trained to treat the spinal column and to help ease back pain and suffering. To find out more information on topics like this, please go to www.north underscore carolina.healthsourcechiro.com slash city slash Greensboro.